Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well and welcome back. Let's play some more EU4 and unlikely, the unlikely Sons of Carthage. We are currently building up the force limit here because we're going to have some rebels pop over here in Tugert quite soon. Um, here in about 1.1 years, I assume. And we get some more rebels from Morocco, which is always annoying. It is my hope that... Uh, these rebels, w there we go. They're probably going to kill off that Morocco stack, sadly. Yikes. I would like for them to go attack this Castilian stack. That would be great. That actually might be where they're heading right now. What? Why'd you go back there? That don't make no sense. Oh, right. Let's turn our army on. Right, I lost my, my main income node, so sadly. Get the army turned on. Let's suppress rebels here. See if that helps. Not really. Professionalism for reassessment survey. Yeah, we're gonna get rebels anyway, so I don't particularly care. Amirs, we can call a diet and they'll be good to go. Taken out alone, like you do. Don't come into my lands, man. Why don't you go fight Morocco's men? Very good. I will gladly upgrade my cavalry. So, this. Province, I'm just gonna raise autonomy. I don't care that much. Viscara. These are all level these are only three dev, so I'd rather just not fight the rebels if I can avoid it. Ten trade power in Genoa is nice. Let's come over here to the highlands. Those rebels are gonna get ticking up again, but we should be able to handle them quite handedly. Yikes. Uh sixteenth and the eighteenth. So we're gonna fight them in the highlands, but it's alright. Losing lots of manpower like you do. And we'll go handle our rebels. Uh, mercantilism is right, that's fine. The truce with Thompson is over. If we wanted to, we could attack him. He's allied to Morocco. Portugal is now no longer in debt. Over to co-belligerent Morocco. This could be our ticket to get to war. Um, the problem is, is I would like to attack. Oh, well, there we go, friends. Let's get over here real quick. I think that's the that's the ticket. That's what we're doing. Um, let's make sure we have our force limit. We're good. Definitely going to be having some issues with manpower. Um, so the idea here in this one is to cripple Tunis, break his alliance with um, Ottoman. Ottomans is in some serious debt. If they were to have a war, I feel like we would probably be safe to not have to deal with them, but we'll see. So let's let these... Let's wait like six months and let these rebels tick down so I don't have to deal with them. Mysticism is fine. Same. I'm just gonna increase autonomy here. I cannot be bothered. Our income isn't being helped that much by them. Very good. Two more months, we'll attack Granada. My general is dead. Wowzers. Mm -hmm. Force force shock is even better. Wonderful. One more month and we will attack Granada. We'll call in both these guys. That will call in the entirety of Iberia. Castile has a huge stack right here, which is great. I don't think they have anybody in their homeland, which is hilarious. So Portugal should hopefully be able to handle them. Morocco is... Uh, How's Morocco looking? Let's look at our uh, rivals here. So Tunis has a lot of men, but no manpower. Yeah, Morocco's looking beefy, man. Jeez. Tunis is okay. Granada. So Castile has... Okay, so between Castile and Portugal, they're contributing a bit. About 30,000. Ay, ay, ay. Let's do it. Do we kill belligerent Morocco? I think we do. That'll allow us to take some clay. We will go for uh, this one here. Maybe it would be easier to just attack Morocco. And then nobody would join. Okay, so this is fine. Let's go for... Um, Leroy Jenkins. Did I not go belligerent Morocco? I think I forgot to. Feels bad, man. Hmm. It's fine. 
We'll make it work. So Tunis will be my focus. Let's go down to speed four. I will focus on Tunis. Yes, I will. Yes, I certainly will. Nice. Let's uh, see if we can beat up on this stack while they're low morale. That would be great. Catching part of his army out on our own would, is a great catch there. So they're going to get another reinforcement tick here, but I think we're fine. We also got shock damage received. So they're low morale. We have shock damage received and four shock general. Very good. Good roll. Ay! Okay. It's a big win for us, though. Let's get up to Kef. Siege it down. I don't particularly care who gets this province in this war. Uh, it's not a huge deal to me one way or the other. Let's catch these guys out here. The more we can destroy their little stacks, the better, because it's going to hurt their economy here. I would like to siege this down. Let's go ahead and work on some spy network here. We can quit worrying about you. And we'll also build some spy network over here as well. Very good. Hopefully we can siege this down in a timely manner. Wonderful. That Morocco stack is wiped, I assume. Beautiful. Uh, that's not smart, yeah. Don't don't kill your men. That's not smart. I assume... Okay, our navy is hiding. Very good. We definitely need to get our men juicy. Get a big juicy army. We should be able to raid everybody here, which would be great. Um, the issue is, is our economy doesn't support it right now. Cannot support it, I should say. So we're gonna separate piece Tunis to have him annul treaties. And um, do you have claims or cores on any of this? You do not. So you shall get nothing. Okay, fourteen percent. So we're making progress over here. They're sieging down Granada. Ceuta is gonna get sieged down, but we have the the siege or the uh, the strait controlled, so we should be fine here. There we go. Eventually, eventually, eventually. So this is going well. This is going very well. We are shellacking these guys, which is wonderful. This is exactly what we want right here. Um, I, admittedly, I could be managing my army a little bit better, but uh, I feel a lot less inclined to uh, be super smart about things. So maybe we can stack wipe them. We did. Wonderful. And so now I can certainly do this. Do you have a siege pip? You do. Let's get you back over there, eh? Beautiful. I would prefer it if they were to blockade for me, but uh, it doesn't look like they're too interested in blockading for me. So they're... We're actually safe. As long as they, they can't get past Berserk, so they can't even get onto Tunis. They also can't get pa past Safax. So we're gonna loot this. Makes sense to me. Beautiful. And then they can handle all this. They're going to siege down all that land for me. They actually gave me some land up here, which is great. I probably won't actually take any land from Granada in this war. I will more than likely take this state from them to give me a fort, which I'm going to definitely need. Um, admittedly, I would prefer for them to get off my capital, but uh, we'll see. Come on, Castile. Get them off my capital. Queen Regency. For how long? Ten years? She's not bad, though. She's definitely better than our old king was, so... We'll probably be able to take enough money from Tunis to uh, embrace, or Morocco, possibly. This war is gonna... We're gonna piece everybody out separately. Tunis to break alliance with Ottoman, and uh, Morocco probably to give me money as well as some clay. It's a bummer that I forgot to co-belligerent them. That is quite disappointing, but we'll make the best of it. This is Morocco's army, so I'm gonna have to handle them myself. Unless we get lucky and somebody joins in to help sort them out, but I'm not going to get my hopes up about that one. Come on now, let's win some sieges. Come on now. There we go. We're definitely getting decent loot from these provinces here. There we go. Tunis has been won. Or let's keep you on there, actually. But you, we can peace out. You will annul your alliance with the Ottoman. You will annul your alliance with Clemson? Nah. I will... I could humiliate them, but... I think I'll just humiliate Morocco. How much money can we get from you? Quite a bit. 92 ducats. That will allow us to embrace institution. And then, um... 
they're getting handled over here. So this war is basically over. Uh, we just need to siege down Morocco. They, we've sieged down all of this over here, which is great. I could vassalize Granada. That would piss them off, but I could give them some land over here. We'll see what we do. We may end up just being cheesy and waiting for them to peace out. But they wouldn't give us the fort there, so... Uh, it may not be in our best interest. We'll see what we can do here. We have no manpower, so we need to be careful about our engagements here. Most of our war participation is from sieges. Almost all of it, actually. But that's fine with me. Um, it's a great way to get participation. They're gonna siege down um, Tangiers here. Very good. Like, I can do something like this, or not this, like that. So that would make Castile happy. And I could give Portugal, like, Salé or something like that. That would be wonderful. Just need to get our participation up so they don't expect as much. That way we can easily vassalize them and we don't have to worry about it. That would be... That's the dream. That's what we're looking for there. So. Very happy about this war. We could probably attack Tlemcen. And that would allow us to get to war with Tunis again soon. And so, what is our truce with them right now? Who are you allied to? Just Tunis. So our truce with you is not up until... 79. So nine years. Hmm. If I really wanted to min-max, I suppose I could go for it. Let's, um... Keep the claims rolling. Actually, I get claims for free on all this. So I won't worry about that. But, um... Yeah, I get, literally get free claims on his entirety of his land, which is awesome. Everything I border. So this, all of this, so seven claims, right? Yeah, seven claims I'm going to get for free. Love that. Our participation should be going up over 30. Close, we're getting there. You guys need to siege his capital down. Please, Castile. You can suicide your men, I don't particularly care. We're up up to 30. Wunderbar. Let's pay off our loans as well. We took Tlemcen, which is wonderful. Ah, he took this one. Yes, of course he did. Well, that makes sense, I suppose. Hmm. Let's give that to uh, Fazan so I don't have to pay for it. Get up to Malia or Mayi Mayila Mayila Malia Malaysia. I don't know how to pronounce any of that. We will go with the prestige. Portugal will siege him down there. As soon as we take his capital, we'll be able to piece him out, and I will likely be just fishing for some PP. Big PP against from Morocco would be great. Help out our because we're definitely running behind on tech, you can see here. It's 336, so we're headed on mill. But, um... And we're actually doing okay on tech. It's just our admin and diplo are gonna need a little bit of extra love, but... Let's just... Mm, I'd rather not spend the mill points. Oh, Yeah, okay, we need to get our participation in there, so... We'll just stand on it, it's fine. Hopefully our manpower isn't getting drained too bad from that. <laughs> Unless we get a disease outbreak like that, then that will affect our manpower quite significantly. Is it going down? Oh yeah, we're losing a lot of men. Algerian separatists, eh? Alright, let's get over there. I can't handle this anymore. They can siege down Morocco, and uh, it should be good for us. Very good. Free money. So this will take away two corruption for Ulema loyalty, which will they'll be loyal again in a month. And then tolerance of the true faith for 10 years. But I think I would rather have 33 ducats. If we're going to have rebels, we're going to have them. So what's the point of worrying about it? Very good. Free money. We can raid. Ah, uh, we need more men. Need more uh, ships. Let's... Let's just get them up there. That's fine. We'll be able to use them to uh, get more trade power as well. So we, w we can get better trade in our home node, which I think is definitely necessary. Cert. Uh, they're getting rebels over there. Kind of a bummer. 
Is that the the war goal? Yeah, we don't control the war goal, but we we took their capital, so that's great. That's fine. I don't care. I'd rather have the professionalism. Our professionalism is not bad right now. So Morocco, we will humiliate you. You will give me war reps. And how much money can we get? Quite a bit. I think it's worth holding on to. Just allowing them to siege them down a little bit more. And uh, yeah, we'll be able to get it quite soon. There we go. We'll get 116 ducats. We'll get humiliate. How much power projection we get? 30. So we'll actually have a big PP, which is wonderful. And um, break your alliance with Tunis. You must. You must. You must. You must. I would like to take clay, but uh, unless I can take a full state, it's probably not really worth it in my my mind. Okay, there's their separatists. It's gonna have to wait until he sieges down. Mm-hmm. We'll take tech. We actually have un uh, unbalanced research right now, so we're not taking mill tech for a little bit. Um, let's actually take a couple of these mill points and spend them. See if we can get some extra manpower. That'd be good. Give us more income, please. Morocco will now peace out. We will get um, 30 PP. We will get inflation, 101, 111 ducats. And then uh, this one, I suppose, we vassalize them and give them those two. Castile doesn't want it. Uh, because they have a lot of war participation. Bummer. Well, let's get my army over here then. Prestige or corruption. Wonderful. We have call for pizza, so we need to take this soon. A white piece would make everybody give me one trust. <laughs> I could just humiliate them for PP. But I feel like I would rather take their money. No. Yikes. Okay, let me see here. That's both negative 20 for both of them. I kind of need them as an ally. So maybe... Still be negative 20. Dang, Castile. We could probably ally Aragon. Let's get some claims on you. I'm very tempted to just vassalize them and say, screw it. He's rivaled the Aragon. Tunis would be a great friend to take against. Clemson. We need a claim, which we can get easily enough. I think we're just gonna do it. I'd rather have the vassal. Super disloyal, but uh, we'll make that work. Let's see here. Can we get you as a friend? Diplo too many Diplo reps. Diplo relations. Bummer. So their trust is going to be super low. We can keep Portugal. If it's over, if it's at least 35, they'll stay your friend. So we'll keep Portugal. Castile I don't particularly care about, so that's fine. Uh, Ulema influence is fine with me. Let's actually see if we can get some more from them. Diplo points we've already taken. We definitely could use admin points. Let's give some clay to the uh, Ulema. Need one more. That's fine with me. Take the admin points. Give some clay to the Emirs. This is Fine with me. I don't care. I don't need the mill points, so I'd rather them just give me manpower recovery. That's fine with me. 
Let's um, go with missionary strength and get these converted. It's going to take quite a while. We're going to take tech so we won't have unbalanced research anymore. That will help out our income. And we're going to be gaining quite a bit. So Aragon and Castile were both subsidizing me, which is quite nice. We're getting war reps for a long time. They're still subsidizing me, which is hilarious. Uh, we might be able to ally him. We are friendly towards him. Okay. Well, let's... Let's get down here. Looks like our general died, which is quite a bummer. So we'll get a new one. Except this guy's got three siege, which is great. Okay, let's have you attached to me. Gonna go into our government tab here. Get our free claims. Wait one day. There we go. We will attack you. Tunis will help. Castile hasn't broken alliance yet. Cool. Alright, so... A bit of expansion. Let's do this. This will allow us to, um... I guess I don't need to. I suppose the best way to probably do it would be to... Wait. Attack Tunis. The problem is, is I don't want him to get any more friends. And he very well could. We could also probably annex Fezzan, though I like having his extra forces in the field. Hmm. Though his forces that he's contributing are helping, so... We need some manpower. Let's just recover for now. And then, um... We'll attack... We just gotta hope that he doesn't ally the auto. As long as he doesn't ally auto, we'll be fine. Yes, royal marriage with Fazan sounds good to me. Um, I feel like we don't need to focus mill anymore. As for first idea groups, I really probably would go something like quantity. Um, something that's going to give us a big, big army and we can handle these guys. Um, we'll see though. Let's get you guys grouped up here. See if we can do some pirating since we are Berber pirates. Let's get you there. Will this work? Very good. We can raid you. Can we raid you here? We can. Very good. Can we reach this one? We can! Oh, we can! 27 ducats. I love it. Um, a mere loyalty, professionalism, it's fine. So I'm sending separatists are gonna happen up here. Probably in Weiran, I assume. So let's get up there and defend if we can. Probably, they might happen next month, it's hard to say. They did not. Alliance is going to break with Castile. That was to be expected. So... Can't raid Midja. Mitidja. Too much dev. I bet we can't raid Tunis either. It's fine. We'll take what we can here. Can we reach over here? We cannot. That is fine with me. Okay, so they are split up, which is great, actually. Let's come down here. Beat up on these guys. This is Highlands, so we'll be able to uh, be Defender up here, which is great. Um, sadly, we're going to have to buy a couple of Mercs, probably. We don't have the manpower to handle that. Very good. Eight Ducats. Protect some trade over here. In Tunis. So let's see what our trade 1.4 or 0 0.1 0 0.4 probably like 0.6 I'm hoping 0.3 so it went down for some reason that doesn't make sense hopefully we get a reinforcement tick here before they attack me very good trade is 0.3 I, I don't get why our trade went down so much Oh, we have rebels over here as well. I didn't even see them. So, if they want to go sit on Tlemcen, which I hope they do. Yes, very good. Let's take this one. We'll go handle these rebels here in a moment. I would like to ally you. We are friendly towards them, so we'll see. Our income is so good right now. Are they still guaranteeing me? They're still subsidizing, subsidizing me until 1493. Yowzers. Well, that's pretty good. Let's build that there. More money is good money. Mm 
Uh, let's get attacked. Hopefully not lose too many men. Get our missionaries sorted out. Ottomans have attacked Hungary. Yikes, what are you doing, Otto? It does not seem right. Alright, so on the map it doesn't look like we've changed a whole lot, but we have actually gained four more provinces in southern Iberia. So we're one step closer to uh, to our group, to our thing here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, those rebels are... We're going to take a straight crossing, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Yikes. Oh, man, it's going to be heavy losses for us. Oh, my gosh, the manpower loss is so bad. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that's fine. We're going to take some time. We have four more years until our truce is up with you. So I suppose that is a good time to uh, just chill. Just chill and group up. Still have no forts, which is annoying. <laughs> I could build a fort. Build a fort, like, right here. I want to take this fort here, though. So we'll take this one, and then we'll take Kef. I could probably build one, like, over here. But we'll see. Hopefully you guys are enjoying. Please share your support. Leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Um, 250 likes on each video. And we will keep the twice daily uploads rolling. So hopefully that's enough incentive to you to take a second to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already and you want to see more. And if you want to check out the Discord or support what we're doing over on our Patreon page. That's the best way to support the channel. The links are in the description below. And with all that being said, we this is Chewy Shoot. And I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to my new supporter, John Thompson, as well as my other two top supporters, Palmer and Bloodbound. Also, thank you to Jonathan Crane, Jaron Clampett, Lambda Driver, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Zwayhander, William Reed, Gregory the Bittersteel, Christopher Pegolo, and Airborne Animal 7. I appreciate you guys very much. Don't forget to check out the series we have linked on the left and right, and don't forget to subscribe.